All right, guys, welcome back to Civilization 5. We are just going to keep flying. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep doing this if you need a little caught up. We are, I feel like we're on the brink of either making or breaking ourselves at this point. Um, we have no more places to expand. We are very sad, like very, very sad. I can't keep building places because I'm going to probably really cripple myself in this game. Um, and so it's not super positive right now, if I'm being honest. Let's see, I'll put you there. I have to get this happiness up. Look at that. Look how bad it is. 14 from cities, 35 from populations. We are cool. pleased to we, meet We're you. still meeting people. How crazy is that? Um, we are building the castle. We are building some shrines. No, it was built already. Shoot. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. Well... Nuts. This would be great, but we need markets in four in three different places. So we can't go that route. We could do a caravan. I think let me before we keep going. In case you're wondering, I had my hands over my head. I was frustrated by that. So we're working towards chemistry, which will improve our manufacturing, all that jazz. We will increase our food production next. I think that'll be our next big one. Um, man, I'm really just frustrated by that. Ugh. So you can go there and fish. Wait. No. If the unit is inside a city-state's territory that you are not at war with, this will conduct a trade mission. A lot of gold. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Cool. So we got a lot of gold. Now we're friends with the Vatican. Excellent. Uh, we need a place for our workers. So we can go down to there. You can go ahead and get farm. I don't think I hurt myself by not doing enough farms. Because the gold is necessary, but I also think that we're hurting bad. Um, let's see. Chicago, Seattle, and San Francisco. San Francisco. There's some happiness. The markets are 500 each. I couldn't do that. I couldn't pull it off. Okay. I was thinking maybe I could purchase all the markets, but I can't. Seattle. 23 turns. Yeah, so it would be a while. Hmm. All right. So over here... I don't want to spend money if I don't have to. I'll get food for that one, so that'll be good. I'll get culture for that one. Man. 
This is really tough. I think I'm gonna have to go with the walls just for protection. Maintenance, 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 and maintenance. That would be huge. Oh, I could actually do that. I can do that. No, I can't. Dang. Because that one's 20 away. And that one's 20 away. Alright, well. to just build up military. Alright, that is built. Really have nowhere for him to go. So well, he can wait. Sorry about taking forever. That was a long turn. I'm a little bit concerned about this now because... I'm just so unhappy. So the reduction in production in um, gold is not that concerning. It's the fourth speed for Um, growth of cities that's concerning. That's the big one. Alright, I do have something for them now. <laughs> and of course they just immediately finish. <laughs> I mean, I'll just send them there. Yeah, yeah. So, at some point we have to getting a golden arrow would be huge, but we're actually going negative. I wonder so none of these this one I think gives us a golden age that would be nice that one doesn't that one doesn't and none of those do a golden age will be actually really helpful here in a little bit for us. Alright, so if we were to trade let's go ahead and do San Francisco. Definitely Minutemen. So us building Minutemen is just going to give us an army. We just have to figure out what we're going to do with this army. Man, I don't know what I want to do with them. They have to hang out again. Sorry, guys. I certainly do not want to take them on. These guys would be nice to take on because they're literally right there. Hmm. 
course they would be nice to take on but they're huge let's look at the um no I don't want to do culture let's do military overview so we know the strongest people right now oh this is us man I'm not sure I feel like half of this video has just been like well now what now what do we do which is a little bit how I feel. All right, build a little bit more farms. Nothing great. So I guess you guys just rest. Rest. And you guys go up to Seattle? Sure. All right. This does create more food. I feel like I just need to do that. Even though I just said, try not to spend the gold for maintenance, getting food is a good thing. Hmm. I'm gonna bring you down here just because I want to have all my guys in the same area. I could use the extra production if I don't want to build this towards something. So like if you come in here and look at this, you can actually just spend all of your extra money towards wealth. And so what is my production? 25% of that, so I'd get three gold. I think they round up. Which actually should be 11, but because of the negative 12% because of unhappiness. All right, what else do we got? Walls, that would be nice. Let's just go ahead and do that. Kind of have a couple turns where we just kind of sit back. Production will go up a lot, which will be a good thing. Universities. I guess there's some strength in that. Ooh. Get a little good combat here. Nice. Always a little bit of combat. Combat won't hurt. Alright, so you guys hang out. I think I'm probably just going to send my Minutemen over to here to deal with this so that I get a little bit of combat experience. 
Aparan to yan aliliron kito lawan ulon. Hmm. See, I don't want open borders. You know what? Let's just go for it. He's way out here. Okay. I think the tough thing that's been about this series is because it's all um, island based instead of continental, I haven't been able to trade with other cities and that's been tough for me. Like this is a sweet cargo ship that I don't have access to right now. I think I could probably get it. I don't even have the cargo ship. So where would I get the cargo ship? Harbor. So confused. There's a work, oh, cargo ship right here. Oh, I'm at my trade limit. I wonder. All right, so I'm gonna do that for a minute. If I'm at my trade limits, if I can get rid of the caravan and just do the cargo ships, I could do it that way, couldn't I? That would make a lot of sense. It's just unfortunate because I already have my uh, caravan people. But that's not a reason to keep them if I can do other trades. Because see, they're getting all that sweet gold and stuff out of it. I'm not gonna lie, just go here. <clears throat> yeah, so you guys go there. Ooh, ooh. You have the ability to do... Coliseum. I'm going to turn them into wealth. <sighs> See, I have too many of these guys as it is. So this is going to help me get rid of a little bit. I realize it's a little bit dumb to get rid of too many, but I still have three that I'm not using. Alright, so I'm getting a little bit of gold from this.
Minus seven. No, I'm going the wrong way. I could actually lose civilization. Would you be interested in a trade agreement with England? Because of unhappiness. <laughs> Alright guys, we're just going to have to continue on. This is one of those, like, just deal with it kind of situations. <laughs> that until we can get out of this funk, which really the biggest way of getting out of this funk is going to be this right here. So I'm going to wait until the next session, and then I'm going to hit a golden age. And hopefully that'll turn a lot of things around. I think that'll be a big deal if we can get that golden age going for ourselves. It'll be a forced golden age. I really I realize that. Um, but I think that that could get us around. We also just hit 1,500 gold. So we could do, what, the three Colosseums and start the Circus Maximus. So maybe that's also an option. So I'm going to actually stop there, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I will catch you guys next time. See ya. Bye.